Right guys, uh, in this video I'm going to show you how to use prompt and um, put all the prompt into a txt file and then you load the prompt into config UI so you can have multiple prompt inputs and export multiple uh, outputs and uh, this output do not need to uh, be connected it can be completely different so for example you can use uh, say a girl and then uh, like a look at paintings, um, battleship, something like that, okay? So I did, uh, got that, got prompt2.txt. Uh, the only thing you can do is just use this workflow, click here and select prompt1 or prompt2, right? Prompt2, and then as you can see, you go through just a normal process with uh, like multiple prompts as an input. I try to minimize things, okay? So I already generated three images, but I want you guys to show uh, to, to, to look at it and you know, how, how it works. Okay, so a checkpoint just the X, uh, SD Excel based model. And uh, yeah, got into this uh, prompt encoding cake sampler and it got like a pretty quick. Okay, so you guys can quickly see this uh, uh, like a person with the uh, umbrella. The previous generation, something like this. Uh, but uh, yeah, we got something like this. So we can quickly got this uh, people look at the image if you look at prompt. The first is uh, a girl, uh, one girl is walking through a street, yellow umbrella, raincoat. The second is a museum, people look at paintings, abstract, all that. And the third is battleground of a, sh a spaceship. Oh my gosh, it's completely different. Okay, so you guys can see, we got this uh, three image generated. I'm going to increase the uh, fit size so you guys can see it more clearly. Okay, we got this uh, three image walking. One is the umbrella, the other look at image, the, th the third is a spaceship. Of course, uh, it does not look uh, perfect, uh, but it's a kind of like a starting point, uh, just a, like a proof of a concept sort of thing. Uh, of course, you are going to use better models, you're going to use, use better fine tuning, uh, you can use like, um, uh, like latent upscale or all that uh, I already discussed uh, in my previous video but in this video um, I just want to show you that you can use this okay and uh, since it's like a really fairly easy model I'm not going to build that from scratch because it's fairly easy just a, a really simple one load prompt a load checkpoint checkpoint and we got this uh, positive palm and negative palm okay um, so basically it's like a collapsed version of a um, uh, of this so we can like convert input into widget something like that and convert text to widget yeah I already uh, already collapsed that so uh, um, basically yeah, yeah I already collapsed that let me let me let me let me show you okay so let me double click um, clip text encode yeah let, let me show you how it's done so originally it's like a text prompt okay so you right click and uh, um, we're going to find Converts. Yeah, um, I believe we can find this. Uh, uh, convert. Where's convert? Yeah, convert widget to inputs. Convert text input. Yeah, yeah, that 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 that's that's, that's the one. Okay, so basically you can convert um the uh, um. Originally, you're going to put this prompt here. You're going to input text here. But things we already got the file for the text, okay? So we can just uh, use this as a placeholder and put the clip here, okay? That's that's how it's done, okay? And uh, yeah, let me just remove this one. Uh, of course, load checkpoint, all that is, uh, is, uh, is, is really a simple one. But here, we need to install Inspire Pack. Uh, if you haven't installed that, you just go to Manager, install Custom Node, and uh, you just search for. Um, um, okay, so it's being updated. You just search for Inspire Pack, or I think it's a Doctor. What? Uh, yeah, Comfy UI, uh, Doctor AOT Data. Okay, Comfy UI, uh, Inspire Pack. Just uh, install, install this. Uh, you should be good to go and then double click and uh, you got load prompt from file and uh, remember if you want to find or you want to like make your own file here i'm using the uh, like official um demo file um so if you you, you install that like me uh in drive you, you can go to the uh yeah, let me just show you okay ai okay config ui um directory and go to the 
the, the, the custom node and this is a node just install config your inspire pack double click and you got this prompt okay and then you put your um, prompt director here so for example you got some you know a crazy uh, uh, say uh, chat GPT written batch uh, file but uh, just remember you need to follow the rule like this so you have to positive negative this is like a sing single node uh, a single prompt but if you've got multiple um, uh, prompt you need to uh, separate by hyphen okay so the first prompt the second prompt third prompt of course you can you can do all through the prompt as long as it allows you to uh, compute okay so i just put all that but uh, it will give you a zipped um, file so you have to unzip the prompt so uh, just search for unzip I believe then you can find unzip prompt inspire okay and uh, just plug it in uh, zip the prompt and unzip the prompt unzip that and then you can plug this unzipped into the positive as well as the negative and um uh, then the the clip for, coming from load checkpoint of course you can choose the model that you like and uh, then a plug into case sampler and uh, latent and um, uh, VAE and we got this uh, image output so it's uh, it's just a pretty normal process after loading the uh, prompt so uh, but the the, uh, the tricky part is that you need to like unzip it first and uh, you have to follow certain rules when you generate the uh, the text okay so yeah you can play around and thanks uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and if you think my video is helpful or just you know the best way to, to tell me that you love this kind of content because I'm this artist um, also I work with AI uh, I worked pro, pro, um, I, I double with the programming I make apps and games so uh, I make a lot of videos so uh, time is like a really stretched uh, so if you like this uh, love this content do please let me know leave in comments or uh, maybe leave a like okay just give me a thumb up so I know if you don't like it's okay you give me a thumb down it's okay so I could get a certain feedback or leave or, or whatever content you want to see leave in comments so I will like put more time on specific field and less time on that field okay thanks bye